Oh, that's nice too, huh? Geez, they're nice pieces. I worked very hard. Every place I ever worked, I was the top salesman. And I was uh, <laughs> recognized as being a good salesman. And, and I always Wait. had the, the best sales records. And one day, um, after my sister and brother died, I decided, well, um, why should I work for somebody else? Why, why can't I get my own business? If I can work this hard for somebody else, I can even work harder for myself. If I can make them money, why can't I make me money, myself money? And so I decided from that day, I would um, gather up as many things as I could find traveling, hitchhiking around the world, and I would start an international um, um, uh, import shop. And um, I ended up, over the years, with three different shops. Uh, they were all successful. And um, I did it all hitchhiking. Oh, here's Protestant. Huh. Isn't that nice? You, you can't describe the feeling of hitchhiking. When you're out on the highway, whether it's in a city or on a desert road, you're free. You don't have a boss. You don't have a... Um, you don't have a routine. Um, yeah, sometimes you have to stop and work and make money. But the important thing is the freedom of it. And I, I think that's what I enjoyed the most, was the freedom of hitchhiking. That's when I found I had time to sit alone at nights in the forest, in my tent, and, and understand myself. I was now a free man. And I look over here. Oh, there goes Peggy. There goes Peggy. Sorry. <laughs> Poor Peggy. Oh, oh, you're so sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs>